Hello fellow doll lovers, it's Janie. Welcome to another video on my channel. This video is going to be the unbagging video for the thrift store haul. Um, I will put the date in the description below and in the title so that you guys will know which unbagging video it is for. So yeah, I got a whole bunch of stuff at only one thrift store. It had a big 50% off sale and they had lots and lots of Monster High dolls and one Ever After High and some Barbie and Disney, sort of like Hasbro Disney. So yeah, I've got lots of stuff here and I'm going to show you the thing I'm most excited about. If I can find her. Okay. It's Calliope! Oh my gosh. Okay, so lots of people, lots of doll people that I'm subscribed to on YouTube go to thrift stores and they come out and they find multiple of these. Not at once, but like in different runs. And I'm like, this is so not fair. I don't have any Goliopes. I don't have any 17 inch Monster High dolls at all. And I wanted Goliope so bad. Her, Elizabeth, and the Shriek Wreck version were the ones I wanted the most. She was one of my Grail dolls. Um, as far as the 17 inch goes, and one of my Grail dolls in total. And I'm so, so, so excited about finding her. I think she's complete. I'm going to open her up and find out. And she was $8.98, but she was half off. So she wound up being around like $5, which is very, very exciting. So I'm going to take her out. I'm so, so, so excited. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. Breathe. Take a good look. I'm going to turn her around and show her to you just as soon as I truly register that I finally have her. She's so pretty. And I think she has everything. She has her earrings and her headpiece. And she even has her waist clipped to her doll stand. If I can get off. See? She has her dress on and her amazing shoes. Oh my gosh. I am so excited about this. I'm so excited. Oh, she's so pretty. She's in, like, perfect condition. Her hair only needs, like, a little bit of work. Like, it's in, like, amazing condition. Can you guys see how nice she is? Sorry about the really bad glare. There you go. Yeah, the sun is shining, and my lighting's kind of whacked out now, but that's okay. She's so, so, so pretty. I'm so excited to have her. Okay. Next doll um, is this bag of parts that I found near the front of the store where they didn't normally have dolls. There's a Swimline Draculaur in here, which I do already have. She is uh, right here. There she is. You can't see it because my elbows are but she's right there. Yeah, so I do have her already, and she's wearing like a lot of Creative Monster parts. Like This is like the cat one, and there's, she's like got green on her, and then there's like a Creative... I'm just going to actually open it and show you guys it was $5.98 half off because everything in the store was half off so I'm gonna pull her out first yeah this is the swim line Ducky Lord I do have her and she has lots of creative monster parts together basically if you guys can't see that so she'll be good for like spare parts but I think that's it as far as that goes and here is another Creative Monster person. She is wearing 13 Wishes Draculaura's dress, which is exciting because actually I bought 13 Wishes Draculaura here in this thrift haul. And she has her wig and her limbs, but she doesn't have any, like, feet and legs, as you can see. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I think this is like, maybe, the, I don't know which one this is, but yeah, that's exciting. And she, there's also um, a dress in here, Monster High dress. And... A mermaid tail, which is also very exciting. When I first saw it, I thought that I found one of the Great Scarier Reef dolls, and I got super excited. But still, a Monster High mermaid tail is pretty exciting, too. Next is this Ghoul to Bat Transformation Draculaura doll. She doesn't have her limbs, but I do have some extra Draculaura limbs hanging around. She was $3.98 half off. And I think she has everything except her shoes and her limbs. See, she has her wings. And they do all of their things. I need to figure out how they work first before I, like, start doing things with them. Because I really want to make sure I don't break them. So, yeah, she's really pretty. She's really pretty. She has the new Draculaura face mold. Her wings are really nice looking. She, I think she's fully articulated. Yeah, she must have been because she must have had elbows in order for there to be a joint. Yeah. I think she has everything except her limbs and her shoes, which is very exciting. She's very pretty. Okay, next 
is this bag that has an Abby and a Laguna in it. I don't know if I have this Laguna because I don't know which one she is. And I do have this Abby already for $6.98 half off. Basically everything's half off, so. So it wasn't $6.98, it was half of $6.98. Yeah, so I don't remember which one this is. Picture day, maybe? I don't know. But she has her boots and her leggings and her dress. She has all of her limbs except for one hand and her hair is in really nice condition. I do have her already too. She's right there. See? There she is. Right there. Yeah. So yeah, that's her. She's in pretty nice condition. And I bought her for this Laguna because I don't know if I have her or not. Let me see. I have my Lagunas behind me. Maybe, maybe I can look and see if I have her. Let's see. Where are you? Okay, here are all of my Lagunas down here. I have... No, I don't have this one. How exciting. Let me know which one this is, guys, because I don't know which Laguna this is. Glare. Hold on. There. See? Yeah, she has all of her limbs, and her hair is in really nice condition, but she doesn't have clothes. But that's okay, because I do think I have an extra Laguna outfit. That's exciting. I don't have this one. Cool. Okay. Next is this bag of two Draculauras. I think this is the re-release of Wave 1 Draculaura, and then this is Gloom Beach Draculaura, and I do already have Gloom Beach Draculaura already. Five ninety eight half off. I bought her because I don't have the re-release of the original Draculaura. I do have a Draculaura, which is back there. Can you see her right there? Yeah. I do have the original. Okay, yeah. So I think this is the re-release of the original, I think, because her hair is in pigtails, and she has plastic joints. She's missing an arm, but once again, I told you I do have extra Draculaura, Draculaura limbs around. She has a mark on her leg, though. The lighting is uh, really wonky. I'm really sorry about that. And then here is Gloom Beach Draculaura. I do have her already, but this one's in really nice condition. She has her earrings and her limbs, which is exciting. Next bag, it has a Venus and a Twyla. I do already have this Twyla, but I don't have this Venus. I actually only have one Venus. Six ninety eight half off. I'm really excited about this. The first time I found a Venus in a thrift store. Because my Venus I got from a friend. So here is Twyla, and I do have this Twyla already. But she's in pretty good shape. She has one earring, all of her limbs, and her shirt. That's pretty cool. She's in really nice shape. I probably wound up selling her. All, basically all the dolls I have I wound up donating or selling. Okay, come out Venus. You're the reason I bought this bag. Oh, did I forget the price? Okay, I think it was... Um, let's see, it was a yellow tag. Uh, it was six ninety eight half off, I do believe. Let me see, yeah, it was. Okay, so here is the Venus. I don't know which one this is. She has purple eye makeup, and I thought she might have been like the Ghoul Spirit Venus, but I don't think so because the up uh, the Ghoul Spirit Venus had more of a grayish eyeshadow, not a purple, and her hair is shorter. So that's cool. She doesn't have any hands, but I do think that I did buy another Venus in this lot, um, this this haul, and I think that there is, um, I think that that Venus has her limbs, so she'll have her limbs, and I don't have another Venus outfit, but I think I'll be able to make something work. She's pretty, though. I really like her. Okay, next, I'm really excited about this. I think this is my second favorite find. For $7.98 is Zombie Shake, either Meality or Persephone. I always get them mixed up. And then this Cleo, and they all have everything, like everything, except for their, obviously, like, their purses and their stands. Okay, so I'm going to take out Zombie Shake, Wear Cat Twin, number one. I'm so excited about her. She was one of the uh, Wear Cat Twins I wanted the most. She's in perfect condition. She's so pretty. She has everything, and I'm so, so, so excited about her. Her, her hair is even in perfect condition, so I can literally just, like, put her on the shelf and be done. And I don't know which Cleo this is, but she is in very bright colors. She has a choker, a belt, a triangular bracelet, some gold shoes, and brightly colored hair. I don't have her, and I'm very, very excited. And she does have all of her limbs, too, so very excited. Next, I'm going to take a break from Monster High. This, for $6.98, half off, it has a Sew and Style doll in it and some other Barbies. Basically, that's why I got it. So I can get it open. Okay, I'm going to take her out first. I think this is the Trishel head sculpt. 
She does have a really dirty face, but it's not like the kind of dirt that won't come off, and her hair is in this crazy mess. And she is wearing this shirt. I'm not sure if it belongs to her or not. I think it does. I think that she is actually wearing the shirt that belongs to her, because I think she comes with, I think she might come with like a little girl, like a, I don't know. And yeah, she isn't articulated, but she is a sewn style doll, and from what I can understand, they're hard to find, and I do only have three or four of them. Then there is a pretty generic Barbie. She's pretty she's pretty cute looking though. I might keep her. And then this Barbie, I think she might be a Cali girl. She's really, really gross. Like she's got a really dirty face and really dirty hair. Um, a really dirty body. So next, I think this is uh, Skull Shores Cleo and Barbie 12 Dancing Princesses, either Hadley or Isla for four ninety eight half off. Okay, I gotta hurry this up. Okay, so here she is. I do already have her already, so I'm probably not gonna wind up keeping her. And she has this um, handmade shirt. I think it's handmade. And then here she is. I don't have this Cleo. That's why I bought the bag. Her bangs are in her eyes. Let's see if we can fix that. Your bangs are in your eyes, Cleo girl. I'm sure you want to be able to see. There we go. She's really pretty. She's in really nice shape as well. She does have all of her limbs. I don't have her outfit, but that's okay. I do have an extra Cleo outfit. I'm very excited about this. Okay, next is... Okay, so this one has a cool story behind her. So basically, long story short, in my first birthday Bonanza thrift store video, I was going to buy her, but she wasn't in a bag, and so they wouldn't sell her to me. And then in my second birthday Bonanza thrift haul, I went back to go get her, and she wasn't out yet, and I wound up getting like some other doll instead. And here she is a month from, like a month afterward or more, and she is here with a, I'm going to actually open it, she was $4.98 half off with two other dolls inside, one of them is more like an action figure. Okay, so here she is, she's just like how I remember her, she's so pretty and very excited, she's in like perfect condition. And then we have this Tinkerbell, she does have her wings, but one wing is very bent, see? She's pretty cute though. I actually do like her face a lot and she has bend and snap knees that don't bend and snap very well. And then there's also a DC Superhero Girls, I think, Supergirl in here. She's fully articulated, which is pretty cool. See? Look at those muscles. And then she can also do that. That's pretty cool. She's pretty nice. Next is two Frankies. I think this is Skull Shores Frankie and Gloom Beach Frankie. Frankie is wearing, Gloom Beach Frankie is wearing a Draculaura arm. I don't have Skull Shores Frankie, that's why I got this bag. For $4.98, half off. The lighting is so wonky, I'm really sorry, guys. Okay, here is the Gloom Beach Frankie. She's in really nice shape, actually. She just has a Draculaura hand. And this hand actually kind of like has like claws, which is kind of weird. Because normally only Claudine or like other animals like that have them. But yeah, she's really nice. This is my first Frankie. Gloom Beach Frankie was my first Frankie. And then here is Skull Shores Frankie. She's very beautiful. I think this is Skull Shores Frankie. She has the short hair. She does have all of her limbs. She's in very nice shape. I like her a lot. Next dolly. Okay, so here is the Habro Hasbro Elsa and a Mattel Aurora. They were $5.98, half off. Okay, so I'm excited about this Elsa because from what I can tell, she's fully articulated and um, has her outfit. Her knee limbs are very loose, though. But she is fully articulated, but unfortunately, she has ink on her face. Let's see? So I'm really hoping I can get that off. And she has her outfit, which is in actually pretty pretty good shape. You can tell that she was played with, though. But she is fully articulated, too, though. So that's exciting. Let it go. Let it go. <laughs> okay, sorry. Okay, and then there is this Mattel Ariel. I'm probably not going to be keeping her. Her hair has been cut. She does have a cute face, though. Molded on top. Yeah. Okay, last uh, three bags. There is a Ghoul Spirit Venus and a Jackie Becca Freak, Freaky Fusion doll in here. And she's in better condition than the one I have, which is why I bought this for $7.98. Half off. I'm going to... Take out Venus first. I do have this Venus, but um, mine doesn't have her earrings. So that's very exciting. And this one does not have her skirt, though. But she's in really nice shape. See what I mean about her eyeshadow being more gray? It's hard to tell. I mean, I know. The lighting's really bad. 
but she's in really good condition. And then here is the, oh, she's so pretty. Yeah, she um, is tangled up in her hair right now, like there's her arm, but she does have her headpiece and her other earring, which is the only things that I was missing. So that's very exciting. She's very, very pretty. She's one of my favorite, favorite Freaky Fusion dolls. And then this is the 13 Wishes Dracula I was talking about, the one that, um, this one has her dress. And there's also a, uh, fake look, like, fakey Barbie in here for $6.98 half off. I would not buy all these if they weren't, if they weren't half off. Probably not. Okay, so this one does have all of her limbs, but she has one random shoe on. And she's in really good shape, and I'm really excited that I have her dress to go along with her. And then here's that Barbie. I know I'm not going to be keeping her because I don't know who she is or what doll line she's from. She's not a Barbie. She's too fake. Last bag. This is the most nostalgic one. I'm actually going to go and show you why. I'll be right back. Okay, so Barbie here is my very first thrift store doll that I ever, ever got. And I just happened to find a doll from that same doll line. So for an, like a nostalgic reason, I bought this one. And the Barbie that is in here for um, $5.98 half off. The lighting's all bad now. I'm so sorry. Let me fix the camera really quick. Okay, that's a little bit better. Okay, so here she is. I think she's from the Fairytopia. Fairy -topia. She unfortunately has ink on her face, but other than that, she's in really nice condition, but she does have some uh ink on her back too but she's really pretty I love the molded top and her wings are also very pretty and the fading on her legs is not chipping off like mine is see mine the fading is like peeling off but she's too wonderful to leave behind and then I do have this Barbie already um yeah she has ink on her face I don't know where she's from and she has lots of pen on her legs but yeah that is all I got I did get a lot of stuff uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Like and, of course, comment and tell me what you think. And subscribe to my channel. And turn on post notifications so that you guys will get notifications whenever I upload. Thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned next time. Bye!